this girl finally made it. It was I'm supposed here. to arrive at 10 p.m. last night. It's okay. I got a band of Ecuadorians by my side and she made we it. made it. We made it. We made it to Quito. We already got some cool. Look at this place. This is pretty cool. I really am enjoying the city and I've been here for like two seconds. I'm sad we're only here for like I'm such a two days. <laughs> Give me your money. <laughs> Anyways, we gotta get some food and explore. We've got our, our chicha. Chicha original. Mm -hmm. Not chicha morada from Peru. Con avena. Con avena. Fermentada. what she said. And we've got this lovely view of this, this statue up here. There's some nice flowers. It's very tranquil. It's very nice. I like it. Are you enjoying it? I am, very yes. much. It's nice to be sitting and relaxing. Yes, after a few hours of traveling, you could say. <laughs> <laughs> and here we are. Mm -hmm. Those are all. Oh yeah, I know. Ooh. The potatoes, some aguacate. I love my potatoes. I know. Look at this little square. This little market that we're going to check out. This little iglesia. Que bonita. Oh, it's kind of crazy, yeah. I feel like it's like, is that Baroque? Is it Baroque? No, is it Baroque? Style? Architecture, yeah. I don't know, I don't it looks pretty that. fixed to me, so. <laughs> Let's check this bad boy out. Oh, this little square. She's gonna make our own Instagram oh, yeah, let's account see. and become famous. It's a lovely square though, I'm really enjoying it. This building is interesting. It reminds me of Bogota. Gotta be really old. This is, yeah, this is, this is exactly what it would be like in Bogota. You have these like areas and then this would become like older buildings in like this older style like. And then like look, like look up here you have the colonial style with this. I don't know what just happened, but either a bird took a number two on me, or someone just sprayed mustard smelling stuff on us. It was the weirdest thing. Like these guys, like look at look at this. They flew you all over here, all over, like everywhere. And something just like sketches me out about it because the guys were walking up behind us, like help me. They gave me the stuff that they just conveniently had on them. And then they walked the other way after they were done. Yeah. They didn't take anything, but... Same Weird. Thing. Update. My spidey sense about that being a scam type situation was correct. First off, I'll tell you exactly what they basically did. They came up, they squirted a bunch of mustard and pretended that it was bird poop. Mm -hmm. Which, I was like, what the heck? Why is there so much, first of all? It was like thick and like cool, and they started smelling like mustard. And the dudes were trying to be like strangely like nice, but in like a non like they were like yeah they were like oh where are you from and they just in happen English to have, like, um, they happened to ha exactly tissues or napkins to clean us off and yeah it was really sketchy yeah. and they were like they were like oh take off your jacket yeah look. like look at this have you ever seen bird poop before it's not that color yeah like, yeah and it stained all of our stuff. Yeah, and it was so. just weird. And they, all these people, like, there was, it was like first the one guy, and then like someone else came up. Yeah. And, and the other guy was like looking at us weird, yeah. too. And he was like trying to um, say, like, oh, help your, help, help your, your girlfriend. Girlfriend. And I was like, yeah. So I feel so like. So he was, I think he was trying to distract us. He was then, trying to get us to like take off my bag. And then he was trying to take yeah, my bag. Yeah, I think it was mainly the bag because I had nothing obvious, like, that right. was like to be stolen. Which is like, where do I even keep my stuff? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, just be careful of that if you're traveling yeah. and just like keep. Cuidado. 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 Okay. Also, they they turned like I said earlier. They turned around and went the other way afterwards. And I was like, they were walking up behind us, and then they just happened to interact with us and go the other way. That was what really. Now I smell like mustard. And need to shower. Hey. Buenos días. Buenos días. We're back, clean from the mustard. Yes. Hoping not to get mustarded on again. We're gonna get some breakfast, check out a market, and we're actually leaving Quito and going to Banya. So it's gonna be another day of travel, but we're excited. We've gone to the artisanal market. We got some souvenirs, as is a must. Um, I didn't record in there, but we might go through real quick and I'll do some recording. 
Everyone loves asking us a million times, even when we say no. Pasando a través de la ciudad, going throughout the city. Almost there. El metro de Quito. We're going to Quitumbe to catch the bus. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to Banos. We are the Quitumbe station. This is one of the biggest bus stations I've ever seen. The Medellin was big, but not. There's just so many places you can go, like the entire country by bus. It's really cool. Everything is so cheap. Like we found the, the one bus was three dollars to go to Banos, which is like a three three to four hour bus ride. And then our bus was five, but it was leaving a little sooner, so like pay two dollars more. So We are now, technically we're not in Banos, but we made our trip from Quito to Banos and we're now in this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful cabana in the mountains up a little bit. It's a good 20-30 minute ride from, from Banos, but it is well worth it because it's just obviously, as you can see, gorgeous and we have all these windows and the view is just great. The birds are also like awesome we've seen i mean you got the hummingbird feeders down there we've seen so many hummingbirds you see there's the flowers and a tons of other birds we saw this cool like blue chirping bird you know we're just like you can see like the clouds and the mountains and yeah it's it's really cool it's really nice um I'm excited to like explore this area a bit more we have a bunch of super cool stuff coming up this week and today our main thing is to explore baños el pueblo the town and then we're gonna go to Casa de Arbol, which is like this little swing. That, like you swing on it and it's like right over and you get to see like the whole, you'll see. Um, but yeah, that's it. One more lovely view of our place. And yeah, gotta catch a bus or some random car down. That might be a, a journey in its itself, in and of itself. Our little pal house, we're going back to get our jackets because it's a little chilly. It's, it's nice. You can hear the cool blue bird. Lovely views. And a perrito that's running away. Yeah, we've heard some barks. Naughty perrito. Izzy has come across a crazy find. Crazy sky. Dude, he's huge. I don't want to make him move. We can make a move. He's posted up. He does not want to move. Ooh. Whoa. Whoa. He's going like long. Touch him in the butt. Oh, violation. He's pretty like on He's, there. Yeah. That's crazy. Oh, there's a river down there. So pretty. A few 
few empanadas that are definitely not, definitely not big at all. I don't care, I'm eating them anyways. Study Audible. We're going to go swinging. Wow. Huh? Do you on video? It's crazy. This is awesome. Here we are. We'll have to take a leap of faith and swing into the mountains. Oh, yeah. Now this is what I want. What a vibe. Here we are. We're going to do the tightrope walk. Oh, this is a good. Whoa. Holy crap. I have to use this rope because oh, there's fishes in there. Whoa. This thing is loose, man. This is dangerous. Your turn. Here she comes. Grab that rope because the log's a little wobbly. Here. He's almost there. Very awkward, I Great work. Oh yeah. Tell me when you're ready. Ready? Three, dos, uno. Vamos. Backwards. <laughs> nice. Numbers. Oh no. Whoa. There he is. Mm -hmm. Back down from our lovely Casa de Arbol. And we are walking and exploring the town. And check it out a bit more. See what see what there is and enjoy la noche vamos so, little park un parque <laughs> this little church tower we made it to a little church here it's kind of cool oh and we can go inside it looks like maybe no sé parece abierto 